Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create, edit, and reuse master slides in Google Slides. Let's go ahead and take a look. So let's start by creating a blank presentation. And we can use any theme that we want here. For the purpose of this demonstration, I'm just going to use the simple white background with black text on it. So let's use that one and let's give it a name. Call it Demo Master Slides Creation. Now, what we're going to do is we want to change the master slides. So, you know, by default, when you go into your layout, you have all of these. Right? And that's part of this simple black and white theme that I chose. Well, I want to change that. So to do that, let's go into slide and select edit master. And we'll see here we have all of these different slides available here inside this, this master set. So let's start by changing it so that we always have the font style of our liking displayed. So let's just click on this section. Let's go in and change the font to, let's say I want to use the Acme font. And here I want to use the Georgia font. So now whenever I use this particular slide style, this is the default font that will appear. We do the same thing here. So let's click and we're going to change that. Let's use the Acme font again. You do that with all of these all the way through. And we can say that for all of this font, we want it to be Georgia font. So we've just edited the first three slides in the master set here. Now let's take a look at changing the background. So let's change the background. And let's say I'm going to leave my my title as this black and white, but this one, I'm going to have a background color that is this kind of yellowish color. Now, I also want to have my little icon or logo of my choice always displayed on all of my slides without having to worry about reinserting it every single time I use a particular slide or choose a particular slide style. So let's go down and I'm going to take out this little piece here. Just delete that little piece. And I'm going to repl replace that now by inserting an image. Now I can upload from my computer. I can search the web. But in my case here, I already have the logo that I want to use stored in my Google Drive. So I'm just going to go into my drive and we'll see here, it's going to pop up in my recent images in just a second. That's the one I want to use. I'm going to insert that one. Now that's really big, so let's shrink it down. And I'm going to put it down there in the bottom right corner. Now I can copy that and I'm going to paste it here. So it's the exact same size as that one, and I'll do it right here. Again, I'm going to paste it in right there. It appears in the bottom right corner on all three of these master slides. Now, I can rename this. So let's rename this and call it Sample Master Demo. Now, I'm going to close this out. I'm going to leave the master editor and we'll see wow look at that title slide has now automatically changed to my font choices and it's put in my logo in the bottom right corner now i want to add a new slide so let's go to slide new slide and look at that when we add the new slide my little logo is automatically added in the bottom right corner but if we go to my layout menu We'll see, oh, there's that section header slide that I made earlier that has the yellow background. Well, I can just switch it to that and we'll look and see 
there it is. There's our font choice and my yellow background choice. So that's how you can create, edit, and use master slides in Google Slides. As always, for more tips and tricks like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com or subscribe to my YouTube channel.